Hey everyone, the name's Lenny here, and I'm back with another review. So, um, sorry if you if um, I've had a broken arm, so sorry if you've been waiting. But left arm's better, so that's good. And as requested by um, Bill Milko23, um, he requested that he would like to see some reviews of the Power Core Combiners Wave One. So yeah. Uh, I'll, actually, I'll start off with Minicon. I actually don't know what his name is. Uh, I'll have with Calibris, that's the one. Uh, so I've got him in this mode because I think it looks funny. Um, I, I don't really like his robot mode. Um, well, it looks good, but he looks a bit silly. Uh, his head is pretty. It's actually pretty cool. Um, don't know if you can see that, but he looks quite cool. I like how they've done the mini cons in clear plastic. I think it looks quite cool. Um, cooler than just plain. Um, yeah, I've kind of got a cold now after, uh, so the world hates me. Uh, he does have a pretty big gun, which kind of makes him hard to stand up um, but the articulation is pretty good I mean in the legs it's good but his arms it can't really move so you can if you want to make him fire a gun you have to have him like this uh, I'm actually shocked that it's standing up I thought he'd fall over um, but he's kind of got these gear things on the back uh, to transform him actually I'm not going to transform him Actually, yeah, I will. Okay, fine. Um, I wasn't going to transform him into his uh, vehicle mode, uh, but it's fine. I will. I will. Uh, just, it's basically you just fold things up a bit. And those of you who don't know already, uh, Sainsbury's has a half price sale on all toys until the 3rd of November I think so go there, I heard they're stocking some Wave 4 Hunt for the Decepticons so that's quite cool mm. and you just tab it in like that uh, it looks pretty silly and it's pretty big for Huffer so I just, I just leave it out uh, leave him to the side to transform Huffer. Uh, it's, his vehicle mode is quite nice. I mean, simple transformation. There's also a orange hood variant, but I prefer this one over the orange one. It looks much better. Uh, he does have the nice all spot blue uh, thingy, the part, what's it called, the connector joints, but they can also be like I know magnet so we can touch a trailer but it doesn't work. You can also fold it up if you like. But actually yeah, you fold it up for the transformation just to start off with. Um untap the hands from here and just bring the legs down a bit. Untab oh, stupid thing. Uh you just bring them forward and just click them. Fold it down and then twist. Twist the arms round. And that's pretty much all of it. You can see that it's taking shape. Mm. Okay, I'll just lift this up a bit. Okay, uh, then fold up the head and then tap the legs and then that's it it's a very easy but but fun transformation if you know what I mean that's what I find with this these power core combiners they've got the tran easy transformation but fun fun at the same time uh, I don't like difficult to transform toys because I don't know they just kind of if they're too hard they kind of take the fun out of the whole transformation thing because, because I don't know, you transform it less because it takes it's difficult and it can get 
quite frustrating. Um, but yeah, it's cool. He does have metal on his chest, which is which is nice. I, ju I didn't actually expect that. Um, I know lots of people don't like power core combiners, but I think I think they're actually really good. They're better than people say they are. Well, the two packs, anyways, because. I haven't got any of the five packs because they're just too expensive for what they are. So effectively, effectively, the scout is eight pounds or eight dollars or depends on where you shop. So you're paying twelve pounds for the drones. So that's three pounds each for the drone, which isn't worth it. And with the Sainsbury's half price sale, I think that's where I'm gonna have to go get them. Um, what else was gonna say? Uh, that's it. Articulation's good. Um, his head is. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, it's a bit. Silly. I don't really like the head sculpt that much. He looks a bit silly. Uh, it looks like he's got loads of. I don't know, acne on his face, which. <laughs> looks pretty silly uh, if you ask me, but he does have a red Autobot symbol like it should. Um, but yeah, he, he, um, the the connectors don't really show in this mode unless you look under his armpits. But uh, otherwise, other than that, it's not that bad. I'm not gonna show the transformation to the combiner mode because there's no point because I'm not gonna show show any drones with him but you can, I'll show you the combiner head which looks like Menasaur as many people have already said um, he does have an an old guy look old grandpa look to it um, I don't know he just looks looks quite old uh, in this in this uh, heads but you know uh, if I do get the five packs, I'll probably display them like with their proper, proper masters. If you want, if you, if you want to call it that, I I don't think I'll mix them up. Uh, that's it. He does have a fold out combiner mode, which I actually don't know what it is because I don't really understand this mode. I think it's just this. Um, no, actually, I'll remember. I'll remember. Don't worry. Uh, do I? Do I remember, actually? I don't think so. Uh, I think... I think it's just like that. Like this. And then you just... Just... Fold things down. Um, it's not great. I, as I said, the mini cons look best in robot mode. Which is how you should display them. Actually, I've never combined this. And it seems as though he doesn't fit. So, quality control. Um, as I've just found out. Can be a bit off. Even with this first version of the mould. He does have issues. But, really, you're not going to display it. Because it looks stupid. Um, I think it looks cooler. Just with his minicon next to him. Um, overall, I give the Minicon, I give him a uh, 7 out of 10. Not the greatest, but he does look cool, If even if you just stand him up as a brick. And how far I'd give him a 9 out of 10. Fun transformation, e um, easy as well, so it's transform him again, uh, again and again. Uh, good articulation, uh, just generally quite a cool figure. And... If you don't like the power core combiners, I think you should start off, give the two packs a go. Um, I think you should start off getting Huffer or Smolder first, um, just to try them out. If you don't like them, I don't think you'll like the line, but, you know, Wave 2 does have some pretty good figures, like Sledge. Actually, the whole Wave 2 is pretty good, so overall, I'd give the set uh, A and A. Or A slash A plus. Um, hope you enjoyed the review and 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 yeah.